a marathon session that has lasted a week. Good morning. The special valedictory ceremony has marked the climax of the commemoration of the Supreme Court's Golden Jubilee that began on September 20. The valedictory Wait, ceremony is a first session for deceased eminent members of the League of Fraternity. At the occasion, Chief Usually Justice Muba Malila praised retired and deceased judges their for their contribution to the independence of the judiciary. As we reflect upon the five decades of the Supreme Court's existence, we are filled with a profound sense of pride and gratitude. Since its establishment in 1973, the Supreme Court has been a steadfast pillar of our constitutional democracy, a guardian of the rule of law, and a beacon of hope for all those who seek justice. Its journey has been one marked by unwavering commitment to upholding justice. Meanwhile, Attorney General Mulilo Kadesha called for the simplification of court rules and procedures as one of the reforms to enhance access to justice. As the world facing numerous challenges, including political, economic, and social uncertainties, the Supreme Court of Zambia must remain a beacon of hope and a symbol of trust for our citizens. On the other hand, Police Service Commissioner John T. called on Zambia not to discriminate against people living with albinism like himself. People with albinism are humans, they are Zambians, they are Africans, and they should enjoy their rights on equal basis with others. The commemoration of the Supreme Court's Golden Jubilee has been held under the theme empowering the next generation of justice leaders. Hanukkah Sama News in Lusaka.